in North Carolina, the Rehabilitation Engineering Program is taking a new approach to overcoming barriers that have traditionally kept handicapped people from going back to work. The Rehabilitation Engineering Program it helps us get people functioning and working for some disabled people, which we used to not be able to do. Claude Myers, Program Director. It has put the rehabilitation engineer out where the problem is. Actually, uh, in the uh, home situation, in the job situation, in the community situation, and, and part of the team that's solving some of these problems. I personally cover 17 counties. We go out to the clients' homes, places of businesses, and really see what's, what's going on. A counselor referred Joe to me and uh, sometimes we are paying for the modifications ourselves and sometimes we ask the employer to help. Uh, the employer did put modifications into the bathroom. We also developed a harness for him so that he could get paint off the floor without tipping over because if he used two hands to try to get that paint, he would tip over. I don't think I'm a handicap, no way. You know, because I'm doing everything anybody else can do. Ray Clayton left a high-paying engineering job in the private sector to work in the rehabilitation program. The challenge is that we're into every area of their life, from aids for daily living, just small personal things, mobility, the home modifications, transportation, and job. And in each of those five, it just runs the gamut from the simplest to the most complex things. You'll have to hold do it with one hand. I like to do it in a home environment. It doesn't resemble a hospital environment. And I think they can be more relaxed and actually perform the way I expect them to perform. Right. Well, we'll check your steering now. We want to see if you can turn very well all the way around. Notice your hand is about to come off of this grip. Yes. Sir. We have a variety of grips. That's Some are uh, uh, easier grip, but your hand will try to slide off of this one. Yes. It's not comfortable, right? You seem to have a little problem when you get over here. You, you don't get enough leverage, do you? No, sir. We'll have to switch to what we call a tri-pin device. This one. When we put it on there, you can put your wrist between these two pins. You don't have to have a lot of grip in your hand at all because you can't pull your hand back when I adjust these pins together. So that, that's a whole lot of allow. There. The best you, rewards I get are not monetary. It's a good inner feeling I get when someone who's disabled tells me they can now do independently things they couldn't do before. I have more respect for people that has been in a wheelchair now since I've had the accident myself and it's it's not a good life to live but it's not a bad one either. Terry Hayes has been out of the hospital less than a year. In the fall, he will return to college to continue studies in business.